Developing tonight, a woman was found dead in the back seat of a car inside of a West Side apartment complex with dozens of families nearby. I'm Tanika Hughes. I'm John Bachman. JSO won't say tonight how the woman died, but they do say they suspect foul play. Action News Jack Ryan Nelson is live in the Confederate Point neighborhood. Ryan JSO told you they do have a person of interest. And John, access into the complex is limited. In fact, my photographer and I were told to leave by security and management. But police say it was beyond this, these gates where they would find that woman's body in a car this afternoon. Neighbors in this Confederate Point apartment complex watched as JSO homicide investigators gathered evidence. From Sky Action News Jax, you can see the white car where police say a woman was found dead in the back seat Thursday afternoon. They suspect foul play. Police activity is roped off. Police could not say how the woman they believe to be in her early 30s died at the time of the press briefing. A woman who asked only to be called Aaliyah told me she came to the complex to visit her mother. I was worried about my family and just like what's going on because it's usually a quiet complex, really not too much drama going on in the complex. So it was alarming. Police tell Action News Jax a 911 caller gave them a tip that led to a person of interest. As of this evening, police had not notified the woman's family. Aaliyah says the community offers loved ones their support. And just goes to show that anything can happen at any time. My condolences to whoever's involved and just prayers. It's just an unfortunate event. I asked JSO at the time of the briefing whether the person of interest would be facing charges. I'm calling police tonight to learn if he was arrested or released after that interview. Reporting in Confederate Point, Ryan Nelson, Fox 30, Action News Jack.